Anybody can shoot a gun, you know. Demo is something else. It's a lot more fun. Staff Sergeant Dustin Wright demonstrates how his team detonates weapons. While Sergeant David Johnson, full of life, does backflips, sings and jokes with the Nigerian soldiers his team was training. Johnson's full-time job was as a mechanic, but he did double duty as a barber. Is there something you haven't been able to fix or do that you've been asked to do on this trip? Negative, sir. Not yet? Not yet. OK. Not yet. Just three weeks later, on October 4th, Johnson, Wright, and two other soldiers were ambushed and killed by terrorists. Johnson's body was not recovered for two days, which speaks volumes to retired Brigadier General Donald Bolduck, the former commander of special operations in Africa. There was most likely an element of surprise that the patrol was overwhelmed very quickly. You're defending your country. Yes. Special forces were in Niger to train the local troops who, according to their commander, were chasing roaming bands of terrorists. Nigerians and their American advisors headed out on what was supposed to be a simple reconnaissance patrol. But halfway through the patrol, the special forces were given another mission, check out a campsite where a wanted terrorist had been spotted a few days earlier. Going out and checking out an area that a high-value target has just been in would be a you know, high-risk mission. 